All right, what's up, guys? Um, today, we're doing one of those review exchanges with my buddy Vasco. Um, he owns Arvo, formerly known as Journalist AI. So I'm going to just probably play around with the tool, see if it's worth the hype. I think they're doing like hella revenue, aren't they? Then I see like reports of 1 million AR, uh, MRR, insane. Anyways, he gave me access to his tool. We're going to be playing around with it. I'll give you my genuine thoughts. <clears throat> and yeah, that's it. For the next couple of minutes, let me eat some creatine plus report my numbers from the day before. If you guys aren't into that, simply skip on ahead using that U YouTube progress bar. But uh, yeah, here we go. Hope you guys are doing well. Um, I ate steak like twice yesterday um in sad and sebastian i don't know if you guys ever been here i'll be doing a series on eating vancouver about this but probably the best western food place in the world um yeah hands down hands down here we go All right, so yesterday we did 20, uh, 12 38 down $200 from the day before. We have Amazon coming in at 172 dollars Media Vine at 109 dollars and the adult revenue source coming in at $9.57. Let's get on with the episode. All right, all right, all right. Um, so I was in their workspace just seeing what we can do here. Um, this is Today is my first time logging in, so I'm going to keep it a buck with you guys, all right? So... Just in terms of UX, we got articles, so article generator, blog automation, which I guess is like, excuse me, um, once you write the articles, you post it. I saw the site optimizer, was, which was quite interesting. I'm not sure how they implement that. I'm guessing the um, installation is like, okay, yeah. Then you copy code into the head and then it just automatically, interesting. It just optimizes for it by itself. That's very, very interesting. Um, is that good for like local businesses though? I, I guess that's good for like general sites. Integrations. Okay, so this is a WordPress integrator. Very interesting. Applica it do it's done via admin login. Okay, versus application password. Um, I think Koala does application password. <coughs> Excuse me. Indexers, let me see what this is. This is a indexer, excuse me. Okay. This is an indexer, publications. Okay, interesting. Social media, okay, integration. So this is just, once you post an article, you can syndicate across publications. Um. I think this is good for ranking in LLM. So this is actually very helpful. Let's see what kind of integrations they have. They only have Facebook and Twitter. Interesting. Would like to see more of those. Auto social. Okay. Oh, this is very interesting. Oh. Social media on autopilot. Fascinating. This could be very interesting. Um I'm going to have to ask for access knowledge base. <clears throat> nice. My knowledge base. Okay. Custom images. Yeah. Custom image. Wow. This is like a real all in one tool, huh? Okay. Lead magnets. Let's see how this looks. Tell the user to, okay, so there's a prompting section. Okay, interesting. Fascinating, okay. AI SEO rank tracker, wow. Okay. Interesting. Right, okay, let's, I think their core product is uh, article generation. So let's, let me generate. So what I did in the background is, 
I generated an article using Koala. And then I, I'm going to generate one using Arvo. And we're going to compare and contrast what we're looking at. All right. So this one was done like a couple minutes ago. And then we're going to compare how optimized it is via Neuron Writer. So let's give it a try. Uh, bu -bu -bu -bu. Where is my article? Okay, generations. Okay. Local SEO. <clears throat> Where did it go? May 26. Why is it in Portuguese? Interessant. Interessant. Uh, how do I change the language? Is it in my settings or what? Well, did I even write the article first and foremost? Okay, here we go. <clears throat> English. USA. Because America. Tour voice. I'm, I'm just going to automatic everything because that's what Koala does, right? <clears throat> Call to action. Let's do local rank. <clears throat> Do large sitemap, nothing for sitemap. Okay, wow, a lot of features might be like feature overload, actually. Sorry, Vasco. All right, now let me save this bad boy. Uh, I think this should be sorted by like recent date. I don't know if you can change the order, but um, definitely needs to be. All right, let's generate the article <clears throat> and see what's up. Oh, I just realized I was sharing Koala the whole time. <laughs> so I was playing around with the settings um, here. Excuse me. Sorry, guys. Um, I just had to change a lot of the settings. So let me try to show you guys what I was doing. I was uh, over here and I was um, changing all the settings here earlier. Um, so that's how you change the language. Everything I used, <coughs> I removed this call to action. I removed all the default settings like this. And then I added uh, my own YouTube channel here. And I was saying how I think there's a lot of features, which is good, but it might be feature overload. And I also like would want to see something where it is sorted by um, sorted by like most recent date automatically, because who wants to scroll all the way down for the most recent, right? Maybe there is a function out there, but I don't see it. So let me now go copy. Um, Koala in here first, and then we will see how optimized it is. All right, <clears throat> excuse me. All right, so Koala one shotted to 64 right here. All right, 64 out of 100. And uh, this is just one shotted. So let me see how Arvo does now. It is still generating, but I will. Be back when it's done. All right. Already, already, already. So um, what is local SEO? Um, this is all done already. So I will just copy past to this. Would love a way to just copy all, but um, we'll make it work. Okay. Now let's go in here. It's got images, so that's good. Key takeaways is not great. This random H1 is not great as well. I don't know why it puts the image as. So now let's see how it does in terms of SEO. And let's just keep the title the same, all right? 
And in terms of like a quick read up, let's read it together. <clears throat> Key takeaways. This is very AI like. I would like to see this removed. Understanding local SEO. Okay. Definition. An H2 directly into an H3 is kind of odd, but I guess we'll let it slide. I like to see H2 into paragraph, like an intro into an H3. This is just simple prompting, so it's fine. I wonder if this is raw dogging though. We'll see, we'll see. Um, I do like the fact that it gets to 3.5K words in one shot. I like the FAQ section. All right. Um, overall, I like that. I like that it adds in images, embeds, videos, does random in, uh, external linking. I don't like that it's not as optimized. I think this is good, not great. But the features could, I, I think, in terms of. Uh, I think in terms of, oh, see, I can create a revision edit with AI. See, I feel like it has so many features that it can get there. Uh, like for example, how do I get this into the AI? <clears throat> okay, okay, so this is already an editor. Let me see the articles again. What is local SEO? like this optimizer is quite interesting okay so okay so this will be like <laughs> i like that cursor for written content all right oh, I, I realize i haven't shared this with you but um this ai assistant is a cursor for <coughs> excuse me so i think <clears throat> Let me add in all the keywords from. Let me try to optimize real quick. <coughs> all right, so an error. <clears throat> yeah, I think overall this tool is good. Yeah, just based off of how many features it has. But from since I started local rank, I think there's probably a lot of things he can do to kind of like simplify the user experience, mostly because I'm an idiot and most people are idiots. So probably there's some things you can optimize there. But anyways, that's it for now. Let me answer some questions from the day before. Actually, you know what? Yesterday's video, two questions. So no questions today. I hope you guys have a good one and I'll catch you guys on the flippity flip.